Welcome to another edition of Biloxi A to Z, the insider's guide to what's happening in Biloxi. This is being recorded for Friday, June 21st, 2024. Scraping the coast is this weekend. The Biloxi Police Department has some safety reminders. We'll take a look. Two Ward 4 council member candidates are headed for a runoff. We'll have the details. The Biloxi Fire Department has expanded its fleet. We'll take a look at the new ladder truck. And we'll take a look at the weekend forecast and list of events taking place this weekend in Biloxi. But we begin with this. Hello, I'm Sergeant Candace Young with the Biloxi Police Department. Scraping the Coast is taking place this weekend and we are expecting thousands of event participants to fill Biloxi roadways and hundreds of spectators to gather along Beach Boulevard. That means there will be heavy vehicle and pedestrian traffic this weekend, especially around the Coast Coliseum where the main event is set to take place. Please be patient, be courteous, and be cautious. Also, give yourself plenty of time to arrive at your destination. Keep in mind while traveling the roadway that burnouts, racing, discharging open flame exhaust, displaying aftermarket colored lighting, or high-powered mounted lighting on vehicles while in motion, driving motorcycles between vehicles, and unreasonably loud or harsh horns and whistles are all prohibited. When crossing an intersection, only do so at designated locations, such as corners or crosswalks. Police officers will be stationed along Beach Boulevard to help ensure the flow of traffic. Please follow their directions. We want everyone to be safe and have fun. Traffic cones will be picked up on Monday, June 24th at 3.30 in the morning. Please be cautious when traveling Beach Boulevard around and near the Public Works crews. A special election for the Ward 4 City Council member seat was held on Tuesday. Jamie Creel and Rodney McGilvery received the majority of the votes. More than 1,000 votes were cast in the Tuesday special election where five candidates were vying for the vacant seat. Creel and McGilvery will face off in a July 9th runoff. The Biloxi Fire Department has expanded its fleet with a new ladder truck. The department received the new ladder truck with modern advances thanks to a Community Development Block Grant. It was put into service at Fire Station 1 this week to serve residents and visitors in East Biloxi. It carries a price tag of just over $1 million and includes LED lights on the door handles and the ladder, a remote to operate the truck from up to 300 feet if needed, and a digital display allowing firefighters to see how the truck is functioning while in use. The Biloxi City Council met Tuesday afternoon at Biloxi City Hall. The meeting was recorded so anyone can watch a replay online. Just go to the city's website at biloxi.ms.us and click here, then click here. There will not be a city council meeting next week because the annual Mississippi Municipal League Conference will be in town. Many municipal employees and elected officials will be in attendance. The weekend weather forecast calls for mostly clear skies with daytime highs in the low 90s and evening lows in the mid to upper 70s. Footloose the Musical is fueled by the world-renowned title song Footloose, as well as Let's Hear It For The Boys and Holding Out For A Hero. This Broadway smash hit will have audiences singing in their seats with performances all weekend at the Beau Rivage Resort Casino. United in Blue, a nonprofit organization dedicated to supporting families of fallen first responders by offering immediate assistance, will host a Night in Blue on Saturday, June 22nd from 6 to 8 p.m at the Golden Nugget Biloxi. The event will feature keynote speaker Sean Tyndall, Commissioner of the Mississippi Department of Public Safety, and Mayor Andrew Fofo Gillich. For more information, visit unitedinblue.net or on Facebook at United in Blue. Hundreds of custom vehicles converge on the coast for the annual Scraping the Coast event at the Mississippi Coast Coliseum. Events include a car and truck show, live bands, a burnout contest, stereo competition, and vendors. For information, visit scrapingthecoast.com. Elgin B. Lumpkin, better known by his stage name Genuine, is a Grammy-nominated Icon Award recipient, legendary American singer, songwriter, dancer, and actor. 
See Genuine perform live Saturday night at the IP Casino Resort and Spa. Tickets to this event and all the events mentioned are available by visiting the various venues' websites. And to see a list of what's happening throughout the month, check out the Biloxi Community Calendar in the June issue of B News Monthly. It can also be viewed on the city's website by clicking right here. We leave you today with views from the city's historic landmark and the Visitor's Central information venue. Have a safe weekend and we'll see you again next week.